I'm bored and I happen to have a day off today. So I'd like to talk to you about a, a rather old game so I don't actually have a case anymore. Well, in a series. Mega Man Battle Network! Mega Man Battle Network started out on the Game Boy Advance. Had a version of the Nintendo DS, but then it was later replaced on the DS by Star Force. Mega Man Battle Network, I believe, it was the 15th anniversary of Mega Man. Games. Uh, Mega Man Battle Network 1 starts out with Lan Hikari, which I see is Japanese, by the way, Hikari. Um, going and doing his normal thing, except you're probably wondering, where's Mega Man? In Mega Man Battle Network, Mega Man's not his normal self. Mega Man has changed, and now he's what's known as a Net Navi. NetNavi is short for Net Navigator. Mega Man is now a computer program inside what's called a personal terminal, or PET for short. And no, it is not pronounced PET. It is spelled PET without the periods, but it is pronounced PET. Throughout the first game, you battle villains like Fireman, Bombman, renamed in the anime, known as Anti Warrior. As Blaster Man, Stone Man, Guts Man. Okay, Guts Man's not technically evil, but he's a rival's Ben Abbey, so yeah. Um, Life Virus at the end of the game, Magic Man, Elect Man, new villain called Color Man, who was never introduced in Mega Man the original series. Interesting thing, actually. Uh, almost all of the characters in Mega Man Battle Network were in the original Mega Man series. Except for Color Man, who's new to the series, I believe. And Colonel, who appears in Mega Man X4. Anyway, the first game you go get through all this, you, and then in the second last battle, you face Magic Man, you kick his butt, and then he gets a piece of the life virus and upgrades. He, he almost completely deletes Mega Man. Until Pro Man shows up. Anyway, then that's all I'm worried because his best friend in Net Abbey is very weak. It turns out Mega Man's more than just Net Navi. Apparently, Lan had a twin brother. But when his brother, when he and his brother were born, he had a his brother had a deadly disease, which at the time had no cure. In Mega Man Battle Network 3, it, there is an operation, but at the time, this is like 15 years before the story begins, so I think he's like 15, there was no cure, and Mega Man, or Hub as his name was, dies. Somehow Lan's father downloaded, or digitized and downloaded Hub's mind into a computer program. That computer program later became Mega Man. I wish the dogs would shut up. <laughs> well, almost Mega Man. Mega Man was missing one bit of his data. There's a reason why Lan's father didn't put that last piece in the in Mega Man. Supposedly, not only just, or probably because they're twins. If Mega Man had had that last piece of data put in him. Lan would have felt every shot, every sword slash, everything that Mega Man felt. He would have felt his pain, which I've heard some twins can feel. I do not personally have a twin brother, so I wouldn't know. I do know, I do know twins, however. Eternal twins. Um, yeah. The Perturner twins. Well, they, they, yeah, what's the guy on the girl? Yeah, you're twins. <laughs> um, Lan is reluctant at first, but he gives Mega Man the data. They defeat the Life Virus, who's told that because his combination between fire, fire, water, electric, and wood, which are the four base elements of Mega Man at the time. Fast, fast forward to Mega Man Battle Network 2. World 3's Defeated from Mega Man 1, World 3 
It actually called itself WWW, but apparently that stood for World 3. I don't know why. This World Wide Web was taken. Uh-huh. Thank you, man. Now I find a new villain called the Gospel. And yes, I realize that's a charged term. Originally, in Mega Man, you couldn't use that sort of thing. That's why base is called that, and Trouble is called that. Trouble was originally in Japan called Gospel. It's a music reference, not a church reference. In the anime, he was renamed Grave. They were renamed Grave, and the Grave Virus Beast, the Gospel, played a huge part. Bang Man 2 and 3 introduced the style change. A new ability that evolves over time. Um, Mega Man 3, Mega Man actually faces the original prototype for the internet. Alpha. In the anime, there was a similar battle with Pharaoh Man, who does not appear in Mega Man. Mega Man Battle Award 4 is not the tournaments with double souls. Of certain navvies like Gutsman, Roll, Fireman, who's been reformatted. Just, okay, first he was Fireman, then he became Heatman when he was damaged, according to the anime, when he was very badly damaged. The only difference is in the anime, he's then reformatted. He's when Heatman's destroyed, or almost destroyed again, he returns back to Fireman. In Battle Work 3, he becomes, becomes Flame Man, only to return to Fireman in the very next game. Battle Arc 5 also has double souls, but it's got a different storyline. Battle Arc 4, there's a meteorite crashing with Duo on it. Also for Mega Man. Uh, or Mega Man 8, I believe, yeah. Uh, or that's the original series, yeah. Um, Mega Man 5, Nebula is still making dark chips and has now their own plan. Mega Man Battle Arc 6, World 3 is back after being gone from Mega Man Battle Arc 3. Uh huh. Or at the end of Mega Man Battle Arc 3. I've never actually beat Mega Man Battle Arc 3. Only this time you get Link Cross. Not exactly the same as Double Soul. You can actually control your Double Soul part, your partner's navvies. Your partner navvies. The other computers. And. Psy Beasts are introduced. Tells our Gregar. Gregar being revealed as what was what they tried to do as a virus beast. Because apparently Dr. Wily, an iconic Mega Man villain, who was also Nebula's head, Dr. Regal's father, of all things, attempt at creating another Gregar. So, yeah. Mega Man Battle Arc 3, 4, 5, and 6 came in two versions. Battle Arc 1 and 2 only had one each. I say check it out. There was also a ROM hack, I believe, of Mega Man Battle Arc 1 with Star Force, Car or Star Force Mega Man. But, yeah, I don't, I've never played it. It's only available in Japan. So, if you can find Mega Man Battle Arc or any other Mega Man, Man, I suggest. Honestly, starting with Mega Man Battle Arc 1, I have played all six, except for the DS exclusive uh, Double Team, uh, Mega Man Battle Arc 3, blue version, I have the white version, and Team Proto Man version of Mega Man Battle Arc 5. I said just pick it up, and everything I'll see you next time.